You see this one right here? This one is the culprit. That's his daughter that he had with his sister. And he's got her these babies over here on my trampoline. Excuse the mess. I'm in the middle of building a fence. <laughs> so we got this mama right here who's on her second litter. We got him right here that was abandoned when he was little. And his sister was abandoned with him with a little calico cat. This little kitty's stuck on the trampoline. He can't figure out how to get out. Come here, Kiki. Come here, kitty, kitty. I help you get out. He's scared. He's a wild kitty. Yep. He'll figure it out. Anyway, we have cat drama. This is like the fourth cat drama we've been through, and it's really sad. Really, really sad. I'm trying to find them a home or find them somewhere to go, but I haven't yet. Yeah, I see you. So, this is the boy right here sent her and her three kittens. See those kittens? Sent those to, brought them to me for me to feed. We used to feed him, his sister, and the other cat that was abandoned. But then they went a little wild and they started having all this stuff going on out here in the yard and taking over. So, I had to kick them out. So, he got her pregnant. With these little kittens over here and uh oh grady's taking a poop in my yard fertilize my plants baby so anyway when i started feeding her he suckered me into it he brought her to my yard to feed her then when i started feeding her he started coming by and he started stealing the food from her so we got to do something about this little boy right here he's causing some issues hey he's pretty kitty 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 kiki kiki look Look, he tried to claim my grandson. My grandson and him clicked off, and I keep telling him we can't have him in the house and in the yard and all that kind of stuff. But anyway, this cat claimed my grandson, and he just kind of looks at me like, where's my kid? <laughs> so I'm not trying to tell my grandson he's out here right now. Oh, my God. <laughs> Are you fertilizing my plants? <laughs> oh, my gosh. Y'all are too cute. Well, as you can see, my garden hasn't went well at all. I'm going to try something else. What I was trying to grow was a bunch of um, <laughs> herbs and things like that. But anyway, it didn't happen. I have a compost going. This is 101. I'm trying to learn how to garden. I'm trying to learn how to make my things private and safe. We don't know what's going to happen in the future. But I do know we do need to prepare a little bit. This is my preparation. I got my yard full of stuff everywhere because I am in the process of doing a lot of things. We have a pool coming up over here. The pool is going to be to catch water if we need to like wash clothes, if we need to do anything like that. Flush the toilet. We have a pool full of water. I decided I wanted to tear down my beautiful bamboo fence and uh, build a privacy fence. I wanted to kill all of this right here. We're in the process. We're not actually done with it right now. Well, I'm not done. My grandbabies helped me. So we're in the process. We've got a lot of pieces. We've got some concrete pieces that I've collected. This is our fire pit that we built. We're in a burn ban, so I can't burn any of this right now. Yes, I see you, baby. This is the fire pit we built. It's very, very, very good. Burns well. So we, oh my gosh, we have just have so much going on this weekend. I have everything pulled out. I've got my coolers blowing around because we had a storm last night <laughs> the kitty still hasn't found out how to get out of the trampoline <laughs> he tried to climb up the screen but he gave up halfway <laughs> they're so cute back to my garden i'm gonna put my garden over here because it's not working over there this is where the water comes down right here what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna section this off and i'm going to put a whole bunch of really really good dirt in it because the buckets didn't work for me. I'm going to take this bamboo and I'm going to put a plastic covering over it. So we're going to have our garden right here in our greenhouse. It's going to cost me mm, maybe whatever the dirt costs now. I might take it out of my compost. We don't know. Yeah. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy yourself. See, you got your, you walked your way back into our yard. I've kicked you out multiple times and now you keep bringing me back kitties The and the mama. You hear me? You hear me kitty cat? Look, we're not going to keep doing this. I'm going to have to find you a home so that you can get up out of my yard. Do you understand? This cat is too much drama, y'all. Y'all have no idea what we've been through with cats here. It's been awful. <laughs> I guess I never showed you my other fence. 
I love this fence. That's my bag. I had this one that matched it. You'll have to refer to the other videos. So here's the garden. Here's where the garden's going to go. See how the water comes down? They built behind me so there's concrete. And so now all the water flows down here and it usually floods. Um, we put a French drain in that goes right underneath there and goes right out. That works really well. I am pulled down my bamboo fence, put up the privacy fence. I'm going to go ahead and follow this all the way out over here and close everything off. Um, I just feel like we're going to need privacy right now. I'm not really sure. When people get hungry, they're kind of dangerous. You need to make sure that your family has water, food, and safe shelter. Even if you have to have, build a teepee somewhere <laughs> that's fortified that nobody can get in. Oh, y'all, my yard's a mess, but I promise after this weekend, you'll see what I was doing. I'm going to change this up a little bit. I love, love, love how this turned out. I collected these two babies. I cannot wait. Cannot wait to paint these. Aren't they beautiful? So 101, do what you can do where you are. This is my other canopy. We have a lot of, a lot of um, things to work with. I've got some bamboo. I've got some cinder blocks. I've got some extra pieces of wood over here. I'm making this into stairs for the trampoline. Took an old bath rug. And I'm going to cover it with a back rug, and then we're going to put it over there on the trampoline. you got to have coolers. I was in the process of cleaning these, but we had a storm. And, of course, we have a child shoe in the yard. But you want to collect as much material as possible, and then you can just get creative, do what you want to do. Hey, Mama Kitty. This is a great, simple, cheap way to build an oven slash fire pit. Got, let's see water, garden. <laughs> now the cat's still stuck on the trampoline. Hey kitty. Come on. Come on, the door's over here. I'll show your baby how to get off the trampoline. <laughs> 